Hi, this is Isaac Hickerson with Hudson Incorporated. And in today's video, I want to talk to you about how to add a guidance line in Operation Center. So to do this, we're going to go to the Setup tab. We're going to go to Land. And then once we get in Land, we're going to find the field that we want this guidance line to be associated to. So I click that field. And then I'll hit my Add button, just like I would for flags, uh, boundaries, things like that. But today I'm going to do a track. Uh, you can do a straight track or a circle track. I'm going to do a straight track. I'm going to say that my implement is 40 foot wide. <clears throat> uh, so this is where I can come in and pick where I want that guidance line to be. So I want to run a uh, north-south guidance line. So that's what I'm going to name it. And then I could come in here if I wanted to edit each point, the lat and long for it, I could do that, backspace it out and, and change that. I could simply come over here and drag the A point or the B point, move it around as I wanted to. I've had some questions about what does enable snap to boundary mean. Um, so if I check that and I liked this edge of this field, I knew it was a straight line that runs alongside this road. So I'm going to check mark that and it's going to take into a going to take into account my track spacing. So if I move this over here, you see that it kind of snapped on me there. It has put that line 20 feet from the edge of the field in order to take into account uh, my track spacing that I put in there. So if I wanted to snap one right to the line, I would check mark that and do that. I'm going to go ahead and turn that Turn that back off there, and so I'll, I'll pull my line out here like I wanted it. And I want that to be exactly 180 degrees. So I'm going to type that in there. It's going to update that. And then when I'm ready, I hit save, and it has saved my line. Now, again, if I wanted to add another one, compare to track, straight track. Uh, let's say I want to run this one east-west. So I come in here and let's say this tree line looks like a pretty good reference point. East-West, again, can edit my points, can snap it to the boundary. Um, right now it's at 270 for my heading. I could change that if I wanted to. I can make it run uh, perfectly north and south of zero or, or 90 degrees east-west. Those are, those are default options, but again, I'll save that. And now... When I go to the guidance tab here, I have my east-west and my north-south guidance lines as you see in here. So that is how you add a guidance line in Operations Center.